we present Ghost AR, a time-space editor for human-robot collaboration task authoring. Our system captures users' body motion and represents it with AR Ghost. Using that as a spatial and visual reference, user authors collaborative robot tasks with time-space coordination. Now, we describe the system workflow. After selecting the robot collaborators, user first plays out the human part of the collaboration, with his motion recorded and visualized by an animating AR ghost. Then, he enters the observation mode to visualize and edit the AR ghost. First, he needs to define the human group using the interactive cursor. Then, choose the collaboration type between either synchronize or trigger. In synchronized task, robot must adapt the human to keep both actions at the same pace. Just like this human following camera bot, if the human walks faster, he will speed up to keep up. With the human ghost of a time-space reference, user can author robot action with a ross powered virtual avatar. User now switches to the arm bot and authors a robot action that is triggered by this grouped human motion. A trigger robot action happens right after the human action in the group. To enable robot interaction with realistic motion performance, we adopt Gazebo as backend robot simulator. Now, user can enter the preview mode and visualize the author task with Go simulation. When satisfied with the authoring, user can activate the action mode and play out the collaboration. During the action mode, user is guided by the AR Ghost to repeat his previous action. Our system captures his real-time motion and outputs corresponding robot behaviors to complete the collaborative task. We demonstrate two more use cases. The first one simulates a human-robot joint assembly, which is authored as a repeated trigger task. The next application scenario demonstrates a flying drone providing spotlight while following the motion of the user, which is authored as one synchronized task. We have conducted a three-session user study to evaluate our system performance. In the first session, user acts out a series of actions to test the accuracy of our motion mapping algorithm. In the second session, user authors a human-following synchronized task to evaluate robot interaction using a virtual drone and a ground robot. The last session evaluates the overall usability of our system through a joint assembly task. 